Right, see through there folks. See that big tree there? That's 900 years old. I'm not quite sure if it's an oak. I'll go down and have a closer look in a minute. It was on telly the other week, on Countryfall I think. I've seen it before. Yeah, that's an old part of the wood this is. I'm just having a quick peep. There's the old... Um, I've been in all these buildings in the past by the way, these old buildings. Have you? Yeah. This tree is probably guarded by cameras or something. I'll be out in a minute and here you come get me. They've met me a few times. You know, have they? Yeah. I'm just doing a picture of it because they brought it to my attention. As I'd seen it before, I never knew that it was a really big tree, isn't it? And it is an oak. I think it's an oak. Big tree, in it? Big tree. Oh, get away, show. Swimming pool down here. I'll get to get my cook get caught yet.
lucky, wasn't it? Lots of men my age going round with long grey beards and hair like what Gandalf. <laughs> there we are now. So look at the size of it though. It's massive everyone. I think I saw it before, but I probably just didn't take any notice of it. But it's only because it was on telly. Great big elephant's foot, isn't it? Anyway, I've managed to get a picture of it now. I've managed to get a picture of it. Like I said, men with grey hair. Long grey hair. Still take video, and yeah, I was, the camera video won't be very good because I'm having it at different angles. Different angles. Yeah, they've done up the barn really well. I went in there when it was derelict. It's all been painted whitewashed now, look. All been whitewashed. The house has still got a some of the roof done, I would have thought, and the walls. They've sorted out the garden and the plumbing. Um, they've been doing up the walled garden, which I'm not going to today. I did that last time, that's through there. I'm just going to have a plod through. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Just have a plod through, dear. That's it. Yeah, it still looks a bit like disrepair, doesn't it? They'll be watching, they've got cameras everywhere. Let me check in the picture in the house from here. There we go. I went all around the park last time. I went all around the park last time, around the back, and I'm just happy for a nice gentle stroll through today. Got to take some pictures of the big oak. 900 year oak. I'm just wondering how it's surviving. It's been so dry and it's seen a lot of seasons, that oak. 900 years worth. Yeah. I don't know if I've seen that last time. coming back loads so each time I come there's a little bit more done right so now we're having a nice stroll leaving 
the old Foxham Park in a minute. Making our way back to Holford Green and awaiting Ophelia. Ophelia waits with tea and cheese and onion sandwiches. She, yeah, a whole mug of hot tea and cheese and onion sandwiches. I've, I've, I mean, I've been nibbling bits and pieces on my picnic, you know. It's been a good day. I've enjoyed it. Obviously, I've got a very narrow escape, high risk escape from the cat. A herd of big cows with their calves going to be milked, but I never knew about a big herd mooing and running. I mean, I'm, unfortunately, I, I spotted two heads. I've, I heard these cows, but you can't always tell things echo. And I just rock bloody well, get out of there. Because I thought I saw them moving quite quickly and I managed, I only just got to the steps. Only just within five seconds of me getting to the steps, the cows were by that little pool to have a drink. And then they all, they were mooing and running. That was an arrow escape. I have to beware of that, if that's where they hang out in that coom. Yeah, it was good though. I could see, I, I could see. It was alright. People they are, if they're Buddhists, I, you know, I don't know if, I, if they're all Buddhists that work there. Over and out, everyone.